Hello everyone, welcome to Talent Open Studio for Data Integration. In this tutorial, we will take a look at the T denormalize component. This component will funct from the functionality side, it will do the exact opposite of what T normalize did in the last video. Let's go ahead and take it source data. So here is a source data. It has two columns, region and item. In the last video, we have normalized the data. In this video, we will denormalize it. So for each unique region, we will be, instead of having four records, we will be having one record. Similarly, for center, we will be having one record. So east, we will be having one record after denormalizing the data. Let's go ahead and see the options available in denormalize. So go to the basic, basic settings, select the column which we want to denormalize. So item and we can select any delimiter. Let's go ahead and select file as a delimiter. And there are no additional advanced settings. That's pretty much it. And if at all there are any same values, repeated two values, if we select this option, that will be merged. So we'll, we'll see about this option later. Let's go ahead and run the job. Let's see the data. So that's it. So basically, we have one record for west, one record for center, and one record for east. So this is the desired output once we denormalize the data. Let's go ahead and make a duplicate record and see what happens if we select the option. So let's do this without selecting first. Let's see if we get the duplicate one. Yep. So there you go. Pencil and pencil has repeated twice because we have added the duplicate line pencil in our source data. Let's go to the component settings again and select this option. There you go. Even though we have duplicate item in the source data for best region, that option has removed the duplicate pencil from the record while doing denormalize. So that's pretty much it for this video. You all have a wonderful day.